Hello, my name is Etagram, and welcome back to Fallout 4. Processes are busy. Cash secured. Task complete. Reward dispensed. Future tasks may be assigned. <laughs> okay. Processing. Agent. Professor. Your arrival was not calculated. Well, I'm here. Preliminary adjustments to statistical models complete. Commencing introduction. I was, am, and will most likely be, Pam. Predictive analytic machine. You're just a broken machine. All systems fully functional. I provide First order approximations of the behaviors of all residents of the region, designated Commonwealth. Rephrasing. I predict the future. What? That's amazing. Caution. Biological life forms behave erratically, unpredictably. All output subject to an extremely high margin of error. Even if you're wrong sometimes, that's unbelievable. Repeat. Caution. Reliance on this unit's predictions is deemed unwise. Operation complete. You are a rogue variable. No current or previous models predict your presence or existence. Query. What is your point of origin? I'm from Vault 111, if that's what you mean. Accessing. Vault 1. 11. Cryo Vault. Believed destroyed. Conversation terminated. Pending construction of new probability matrix. Rephrasing. Goodbye. <laughs> okay. What a strange one. I guess I have to go outside. Ah, this part right here. Hello, machine. This is private property. Talk. Push. Go away. Let me in. Edward Deegan asked me to come here. That was different. Let's 
go meet the boss. Where are you? One moment, one moment. I just have to... <coughs> Fail. Damn. Clearly, I'll need to adjust the mixture. Hello, hello. Welcome to Cabot House. I'm Jack Cabot. Pleased to meet you, Jack. And I am very pleased to meet you. Edward finds it tiresome. But I always like to know personally everyone who works for me. Please, have a seat. How about a drink? Edward. The good bourbon, eh? Please, have a seat. This place almost looks pre-war. Now, before we get down to business, I have a question I like to ask all my new employees. Is this really the time Don't for... interrupt, Edward. The question is this. Do you believe there is other intelligent life in the universe? Let's go ahead and put this right here. And take a seat, I guess. Hmm? And of course, I can't seek down in from here. Let's try from here then. Go ahead. Still no. Fine, I'll sit next to him. There we go. The universe is a big place. Anything could be out there. Wonderful. Most people's minds are too narrow to admit the possibilities of an infinite universe. But I'm not talking about flying saucers and little green men. I'm talking about the hidden history of our planet. The very origins of human civilization. Ancient powers that modern science, even at its pinnacle, could barely begin to comprehend. That's really interesting. I... well, hmm, no. I got nothing. I'm glad to hear you say that. <laughs> it's become my life's work. My approach is to combine a rigorous scientific method while keeping an absolutely open mind. So much has been closed off to us simply because people assumed they already knew the answers. My father excavated a city in the Rub al Khali in Arabia, which he dated to more than 4,000 years before the rise of any known human civilization. The structures and artifacts were strange, disturbing even, clearly not constructed for or by humans. I've spent my life trying to decipher what he uncovered. Jack, can I tell him what I need him to do? I'm sorry, Edward. I just get carried away sometimes. You're sending him to look for the missing shipment? Yeah. Well then, I'd better leave you to it. We'll talk more about this some other time, when things are less rushed. It isn't important now. Welcome to the family. Okay. You're officially hired. Congratulations. I'm ready to get to work. Good. That's part of the job, by the way. It's best to keep an open mind. Jack may be eccentric, but he's definitely not crazy. The job I got for you is simple. Jack owns a facility north of the city. There's an important package that went missing between there and here. I need you to track it down and bring it back to me. Any questions? You haven't told me half of what I need to know. Keep your shirt on. I'm getting to it. You should start at Parson State Insane Asylum. Don't let the name spook you. It's just a secure building that we're using. We think the courier got ambushed as he was leaving the place. The guards heard gunfire in the distance, but we don't know exactly what happened. Check in with Maria at Parsons. She's in charge of the security force there. She can point you in the right direction. You all set then? 
and I'll see you soon with the package. Good luck. Don't get killed on your first job. You know what? Before I uh, continue on with that mission, let's go see what the. Uh... Let's go see what um, other people need around here. Carrington wants word. On my way. Where are you at? That yeah, must be napping. Hey, Doc. Ah, good, you're here. There's been a development. A raider gang. Well, I hope that you enjoyed the show. And if you did, subscribe, like, and ring the bell so you can get more episodes. And don't forget to visit our Patreon site. And I will see you on the next episode. Goodbye.